Hello, hello. This will be a December 2022 message for those who resonate with the sign of Capricorn. It's your girl, Empress Cheryl. I did not introduce myself. So anyway, this will be a December reading for um, Capricorns. I will do like a general reading first and then we'll just kind of flow into business and love. We'll just see, you know, how it goes, how it flows um, and go from there. Uh, these are my Jazzy Divinely Inspired Messages uh, cards. The link to order them are below in the description box. Um, also in the description box, you will find uh, the ability to book a coaching session as well as um, a goal manifestation reading. Also, um, my Amazon wish list because I want some more decks to use for the channel. So if you feel so pulled to um, gift me with something, I would appreciate it because it's December and December is my birthday month. Um, so anyway, that's that. Let's get into your reading. All right, so Capricorn. Capricorns. Shout out to those Capricorns who have December birthdays as well. Happy birthday to you. Um, all right. Capricorn, general message. Spirit, what do you have for the Capricorns for December? Okay, we have eat healthier. You may need to pay attention to what you are eating this month, Capricorn. Um, connect with your ancestors. Focus, conviction, determination. Um, and we have 999, completion of a cycle, new things coming, wisdom, and maturity. Okay, so what I'm actually getting for you, Capricorns, is that like there's some need for you to... I'm just getting pushed through. So it's like... Maybe like stay focused, stay determined with this eat healthier. If you have recently like changed up your diet or changed up, you know what I'm saying? Like the way you're eating, continue to do that. I know that we're in the holiday season um, and it may be hard, but it's like, I feel like they're pushing you. Maybe you eating better. If if this is resonating with you in terms of like eating healthier. So is it eating healthier or making um, doing some type of um, some type of healthy choices or whatever that you're doing. I feel like your ancestors are guiding you or wanting you to know to push through during December. Um, continue doing this month during this month because it's helping you complete some type of cycle. Like it's it's allowing you to um come to new things or gain some type of wisdom or mature in some area okay um or it, it could just be allowing you to connect with them better but i'm just getting more so like you needing to stand strong stand firm and whatever it is whatever decisions you recently made or whatever it's like it's just kind of a pull for you to push through in december because you have the ability of completing a cycle of learning something of you know what i'm saying like maturing being becoming wiser you know or, or something like that so like just continue to push through is is the biggest message that i'm getting um with that one but also connect with your ancestors uh as well or you likely will be connecting with them they may be giving you some type of wisdom they may be assisting you with completing some type of cycle um maybe you need to feed your ancestors <laughs> like you know what i'm saying if y'all have an ancestor altar or something like that you might need to give them a plate of healthy food take what resonates <laughs> for you here but um whatever journey you're on like just stay focused push through Push through is, is the, the big energy for the month of December, okay? Um, what do you have for Capricorns? We have Weasel. It says, be silent, pay attention, and simply observe with your eyes, ears, and physical feelings what is happening inside and all around you. So, I'm actually getting that with the connect. Like, you're going through some sort of 
transformation or something. It's like you're coming into some sort of knowledge or, or feeling or, 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 or something. And it's like, you're really needing to tune in. Like you're needing to be present. You're needing to understand that during the month of, of December, like focus, like you need to understand that there are some things that are changing. Like you're going through some type of change. Like I wanted to say upgrade, you're going through some type of upgrade or something is occurring within you that you really need to push through you really need to stick to whatever plan and 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 acknowledge it pay attention to what is is going on um with yourself continue to be present that's like you know what i'm saying the overall energy for the month of december for you capricorns um let's see what else spirit overall energy we have snow leopards take some time out of your usual life and spend it in solitude Okay, so um, this may be what will help you connect with your ancestors. What I'm getting with this is like um, meditation. Like if you have not already um, started meditating or something like that, like it may be time for you to meditate or just kind of just spend some time in quiet, just silence. Like, you know what I'm saying? Cutting off the TV, getting away from, um, you know, like a big crowd or you know whatever the case may be like get getting some time to yourself where you can actually like think tune in you know what i'm saying with this be silent it's like maybe it's too much noise around you or too too maybe it's too much going on and it's like they're wanting you to get quiet and connect they're trying to tell you something is really what i'm getting we have this tortoise card here which says you're too fragmented so do whatever it takes to get grounded they want you to get grounded december for you capricorn is really feeling like a month where you're being called to connect. That's what I'm, again, I'm, I'm getting like, you're going through some type of upgrade Capricorn. And so it's like, you may need to eat healthier. You may, you, you may notice yourself like eating healthier or wanting to eat healthier, um, wanting to get still. Like you may be wanting to be by yourself, like wanting to become grounded, meditate, whatever the case may be. Like, I feel like that's that's the overall energy for you um for the month of december okay so like go with it if that's what you're feeling if that's the urge then go with it because it, with it with you doing that comes like new wisdom is 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 what i'm getting okay so let's see what's going on with you in terms of business career and finances business career and finances for the capricorns december 2022 capricorn business career finances okay we have the king with sun energy i powerfully lead my mission okay um regal powerful passionate courageous, sovereign, responsible, benevolent, creative, innovative, decisive, directive, inspiring, visionary, respected. Okay, so y'all didn't throw on y'all red coat, red robe <laughs> or something. And it's like, I feel like y'all understand who you are. It's like you understand your power in work or the power that you have and what you're doing um you know like within your career within your business or whatever it's like or you're putting on that you're you're putting on that um responsible sovereign regal energy as you move about you know what i'm saying in your work in what you're doing you know it's like and it's like you're respects it because you are powerfully leading your mission what mission are you on capricorn let's see let's get some more energy for your business and career business and career business and career for december Let's see, business and career. 
Okay, we have the Merchant. This came out um, reversed, which this is a Merchant card, Mercury Energy. It says, opportunities to prosper are everywhere. So, with it being reversed, actually what I'm getting with this is you're you're likely focusing on one thing especially with this i powerfully it coming after i powerfully lead my mission it's like you're going back to focusing on one thing like maybe you were at a point where you're like you know multiple streams of income i'm do this then i'm gonna do this and i'm gonna do this but it's like what i'm getting with this is more so it's like nah you're not worried about every other thing it's like I want to do this thing. This is the thing that I do. This is the thing that I want to show up in. This is, you know what I'm saying? This is the thing that I'm like, you know, say this is my thing <laughs> or something like that. You know what I'm saying? It's like you're deciding what it is that you want to do, what it is that you want to move forward in and you moving forward in it. It's like you, it's and maybe you're noticing that some other things were like a uh, distraction in a sense or kind of like pulling away from what it is that you really wanted to do or what it is that you really feel like you were called to do or supposed to do or something like this with this mission um here so it's like you are you're not looking at all the other opportunities that you can make money you're focusing on this one thing that you were called to do okay we have the mystic here i am spiritually i am spiritually wealthy okay some of the and what i'm honestly getting with that is like you were yeah you're guided to do this it's like you were guided you're 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 being guided in your business as well so some of the keywords here are spiritual sensitive unconventional transcendent intuitive introverted illuminating artistic ingenious intense imaginative innovative revolutionary rebellious mysterious you're probably doing something that other people either have not done before and it's like you're be, you're doing it because you're being guided to do it and that may be why you're connecting so close with your ancestors or why your ancestors are wanting you to connect with them um throughout this month because it's like you're doing something different so it's like maybe they want you to get silent get connected so they can give you some type of downloads or whatever but it's like that's how you're moving and you're taking that with you for your in terms of your work and then you have the communicator card which is um mercury energy which says words have power um so it's like you're articulating what it is that you you know what what i guess you're articulating what it is that you want to do like now you're showing up and telling people like this is what i want to do this is how i'm you know going to move this is how i'm going to conduct, conduct business or something like that like with this truthful outspoken flexible clear relatable friendly intelligent open-minded intuitive discriminating informed these are just some of the key words here on this card but it's like how i'm getting it more so is like you're speaking out about how you want to move about how you want to do business like how what what direction you want things to go and with this i powerfully lead my mission you like i'm the lead i'm the boss here uh you know what i'm saying so it's kind of like that's what's that's what i'm getting here it's like you are speaking out about how the direction that you want things to go in and it's like i feel like you're doing that because you you feel empowered because you've been connecting with your ancestors with your spirit guides because you've been like you know what I'm saying? Like paying attention, being in tune, like meditating, becoming grounded or whatever. Like you're, so you're clear, you're sure on what it is that you want to do. And so you stepping in powerfully. All right. So let's move to love, love for you. December, 2022, love for Capricorns, Capricorn, December, 2022 love spirit love messages okay we have release your ex the time has come to clear your energy 
and then we have chemistry there's a strong magnetic attraction here okay so it looks like you still need to release an ex there's someone that you need to release um and it may be so with them two coming out together honestly i'm gonna take that as there's still some strong magnetic attraction between you and your ex and that's likely why it's you struggling to release like look at this person here <laughs> with they are you know they are right here they like hey man i don't want to let it go <laughs> And I don't want to, you don't want to let it go. But that's what Spirit's saying, though. Like, you <laughs> release your ex. Okay, let's see what else. What else is there for Capricorns in love? Capricorns in love, Spirit. What message do you have for them? What message do you have for them? Mm-mm. That's all y'all need to know. Release. <laughs> what do we have here? Spirit, is there any more for Capricorn? Codependency. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. Okay, so yeah. So either it's um, codependency in terms of this person who you're connected to like who you're not wanting to let go or it could be like actual you know addictions like what addictions do you have um that you need to let go of that you need to release that are affecting you you know moving forward in love and then we have worth waiting for divine timing is at work in your love life okay so it's like spirit is just kind of urging you to clear up what it is that you need to what it is that you need to clear up whatever addictions that you have whatever you know person or connection that you're holding on to that you know you need to release that you may know is not healthy for you is what i'm getting um spirit is just kind of urging for you to like let that go and understand that um divine timing is at work of your at work in your love life if you release this thing that you know is not healthy for you then you'll be able to you know move into whatever direction you know you need to move into but overall i'm getting like the need for you to like get still get to yourself connect with your ancestors and just kind of see what direction that you need to take um for the month of december okay so that's your message, Capricorns. Y'all take care.